this dad is who everyone in Japan has been talking about the past week, all because he's about to go on leave to take care of his newborn son. It's not just because Shinjiro Koizumi is the first minister and the first male MP to do this, but it also because hardly anyone in Japan expects a father to take parental leave. It's nearly always mothers doing it. Japan actually has one of the most generous paternity leave in the world. Dads can take up to a year off, but the thing is, hardly anyone takes it. Only 6% of working dads did in 2018. Basically, young fathers are scared to go up to their bosses and say, hey, can I take paternity leave? because they fear that may kill their career. There have been claims of fathers being sidelined after taking paternity leave. That sounds pretty familiar to us working mums, doesn't it? This is a society where men rank as one of the least helpful in the world when it comes to housework. But there have been some political and business leaders who have taken paternity leave, and they say their male staff have followed suit. Koizumi is by far the most high-profile person to do this, and he says he too wants to change mindsets. But there are skeptics. Koizumi is a rising star in Japanese politics. In recent months, he's faced some controversies where he was criticized for being politically inexperienced or too arrogant. Critics say he's just trying to boost his popularity, but even if it's just a stunt, this could send a message to other Japanese dads-to-be that they too shouldn't be afraid to ask for some time off. 